nigga, Sabo. Sabo. Ah, you see, I knew he was crying. Yo, imagine that. <laughs> that. That's the only thing that would make full sense. Like, yo, he couldn't save somebody he didn't fully remember. Man, that's emotion right there, nigga. I get all those memories back, and then in me getting my memories back, the first thing I see is that my brother is dead. What's good, yo? We back RTTV. What up, gang? And if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash that subscribe button. And we're back with some One Piece here on RTTV. Oh, damn. We about to get to the end. Yeah, so uh, Fujitora, he prostrates in front of the entire world, man. Shows that the, govern the world government is at fault for what's happened at Dress Rosa. Mm. The five elders, and most importantly, Akainu is furious. He's like, yo, you made us look weak. Don't you bring your ass back to no Navy base <laughs> until you get the Law Pirates, the Heart Pirates, and the Straw Hats, man. Until you bring them back. Word. He's like, that's exactly what I wanted. Mm. So let's see how the aftermath mm. continues here in Dress Rosa. You guys ready? Yeah, yes, we sir. know we never talked about it in the last episode, too, how like um, the new generation, these niggas is going after Shanks. And, uh, oh, how like and, uh, yeah. Eustace Kid and uh, Apu are going out. You're right. Yeah. Yeah, how they're going up this. Yeah. And they showed the kind of where like the new generation was yeah. across the world. Yep. Um, they showed a silhouette of Kaido, I feel like, with the horns and shit like that. Yeah, on the, like, in uh, Sky Island? Yeah, because mm -hmm. it was like, yo, Kaido. Like, there, was a, there was a dress in Kaido and they showed a silhouette. I thought it was a mountain, but I'm like, they're not going to be talking to a mountain and shit. Well, let's get into these next two episodes, man. If you guys want to watch ahead on our One Piece reactions, it's one to two weeks ahead, and you can do so on our Patreon, man. You can catch the full uncut reactions there as well. Patreon.com slash RTTV underscore. Let's do it. And guys, we are aware this is an anime canon episode, but... Because it's featuring my boy Sabo, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I thought it was because it's featuring Kairos. <laughs> Dang, he wasn't playing when he said he's gonna turn in. Yeah, I mean, he turned in fast. Law too. Law been waiting to fall asleep, nigga. Yeah, you went through mad shit too, bro. Zoro grabbed this so quick. Yeah, right? <laughs> Sabo! Got you, my nigga. She got souped, nigga. <laughs> it makes sense. They were that revolutionary arms together. See, CP0. CP0. どっちにしろ長く留まる気はねえよ。にしてもエースの他に3人目の兄弟がいたとは。まったくだ。発明だぜ。だろうな。一番驚いたのはルフィだろう。ああ、supposed to die. He's saying like when the thing blew up. Yeah, yeah, when he's on the boat, when yeah. the celestial dragon shot the boat. That boy, dragon. Bird cage. That's wild. Birds is outside the cage. He wants to be one of those birds to be finally flying. And that's where Dragon came in. Mm. 
I really hate Celestial Dragons, bro. Yeah. That's how I know they did them. Like, they did those characters right. Because it's like, you're supposed to hate them, like, mm -hmm. to the finest core of your fibers of the body. Boy, Dragon. The wind. <laughs> the wind. The wind. <laughs> I ain't referenced a win in a long time. I actually did. <laughs> that's his power. <laughs> nigga, that's his devil fruit. Nigga, he controls the wind. He controls the weather. I think it's like Storm, but a nigga. His instincts just tell her, I don't want to go back there, bro. That nigga cool. He look like Radix. And they did. <laughs> nigga, I'm nice, bro. <coughs> he said, bro. <laughs> Don't think I can't fight. <laughs> Damn, that nigga's making him work. Mm. <laughs> 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 nigga, Sabo, my Sabo. Look, my boy looks like gold tenant. Um, oh, yeah. Trunks. Yeah, Trunks. <coughs> Kuma's like, fight me, nigga. That's lit. Imagine having sparring partners like that yeah, every that's day. Different. That's why he's nasty, bro. Mm -hmm. My boy was able to fight Devil Fruit users before he had Devil Fruit. Then he got Devil Fruit, and I was like, damn. Oh, shit. Mmm. I like how they gave it context of how he ended up getting that weapon back. Mm -hmm. Like, you didn't have it the whole time. It's, it's actually a new version of the weapon. <laughs> Oh, he went oh, after the dragon. <laughs> Got me fucked up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so he didn't get his memory back till he was like 17? Or, or I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that he didn't have his memory the whole time until he saw the paper of days. Yo, imagine that. <laughs> that and, that's probably, and that's probably why he didn't go. Yeah, that's that probably why he didn't go. Facts, nigga. This nigga never do. That nigga dodged every bullet. Nigga. Observation of hockey, yep. my nigga. I remember hockey. Yeah, he did he... that all at 17, nigga. That nigga's a beast. That's why you're savage. That's fire. That's so crazy because he has all these moves in his back pocket with just hockey. He didn't even have to go in his back of the devil fruit, my nigga. Like, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, I got him too far, Come Sabo. on, man. The best brother. Nah, you're right, bro. I really feel like that's it. That, that's the only thing that would make full sense. Like, yo, he couldn't save somebody he didn't fully remember. When he saw the papers, like, everything came back to him because it's such a trauma of lo traumatic of losing a brother like that. Episode one. Yeah, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's crazy. Wow. That's, That's crazy. just crazy. That's crazy. That's really crazy.
Everybody's in a frenzy right now. <laughs> Dragon just calmly tells him, Yeah, Luffy's my son. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's got that's mine. Wow. See, that's that storytelling. Wow. That just hit me right there in my heart, nigga. Imagine right. all those years you don't know that nigga, then bow, nigga. It all hits you at once, nigga. <laughs> yeah, that shit. That's just realistic as fuck, bro. Oh, that shit just comes flashing at yeah, once, bro. It's like, bro. yo, I'm twenty. Wow, well, I'm twenty, 20 years, years old, old now, yeah. and my brother just died. That shit's sad. He can't even say nothing, bro. That feeling, like, I don't, nobody, I don't feel like that's a feeling nobody could ever get like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's just, the way they, they phrased it too, the way they pitched it is like two, how many years has it been? 13, 13 years since he left them, right? 12 years. It was seven? No, Luffy was seven. Yeah, yeah 12 years or 11 years, one of them. No, it's 10 years because when that happened, he was 10 years old or shit like that. And now he's 20. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this nigga dragon was around for Sabo and all his revolutionary war mm -hmm. buddies, but like. Nah, his son's life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it has to be for a reason, bro. Yeah, because he actually has his memory. It's a good story. Don't fucking end this shit. <laughs> That's why you interrupted the story, Zoro. Yo, Wells, get your character, Wells. Hey, 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 you gotta share character. the bottle, man. You gotta share the bottle, bro. Oh, yeah, bro, what the fuck? That's a good story. Need some good LQ. Yeah. That's when they made it return. Where was it again? Um, was it Bang and Sabote? It's Sabote, right? Yeah, yeah reunited there. We're gonna regroup here two years later. Fully trained. They said they got a, that place like that in Japan. A uh, shrine like that for them? Is that white beard too? Yeah, white yeah. beard. Yeah. Yes. Sabo! Like, this is a such a touching moment, bro. Yeah. Like seeing all that just makes this moment hit even harder for me. Like, yeah, yeah. that's real shit. I've been knowing that. <laughs> you push him out the way. <laughs> Don't ever hug me like that. Yeah. Ever, yeah, put your nuts in my face. You can't hold nobody up like that. <laughs> if I had to hold y'all up, I couldn't hold me up like that. But like, you definitely can't hold me up, Jay, up like that. But. <laughs> 
I can squat 225, nigga. I can squat 225. I can put y'all right here. Bro, that's a lot of weight. Like, it's, 225. It's, it's gotta. <laughs> nigga, like trying to lift a human being and trying to lift weights. It's a different type of way. <laughs> you you do the weight distribution. What do you mean? Like, I'm not gonna be forward. I'll be on backwards. Oh, yeah, yeah. Damn, man, that's emotion right there, nigga. Fuck. And this is off an anime canon episode. Nah, nah, this is this is canon. This is off a canon episode, <laughs> nigga. Fuck. Oh, this is off part of this Yeah, yeah, yeah. This nigga smiling in his sleep right now. There was like just, I, there was mix, uh, mixed filler stuff, but it was more so just to dramatize like the moment. You feel ah, me? I see. But all this is real. See Jerry, I'm always talking before, like these niggas still gonna mm -hmm. wanna take him down even though they saved the day. Yeah, he's such a dope ass character. His man. dialogue is never put to waste, my nigga. Like he really so pretty believes much what in like the other destiny. To rest and then, um, Fujitaro was like, nah. So basically, yeah, he let gonna... like the one that, like the one represents not capturing him. Yeah. Okay. So he rolled the dice. One came out. So I'm not gonna capture him. Because he's a gambling man, you know? Yeah. So he lets like that that kind of fate decide his decisions. Mm -hmm. We literally met him in a gambling place. Yeah. She's gonna be better than Vivi. People really fuck with Vivi, yo. That's just fucking crazy, bro. What's wrong with her? Huh? What's wrong no, I didn't her? know people really fuck with her like uh, that. That's what I'm saying. Like to this day, like. This thing is riding on fucking birds. <laughs> That's crazy. Like <laughs> a different. He was talking to them though. No? Oh? Yeah. He was talking to them. Oh, I thought he was talking to himself. I'm like, nah. Yeah, I'm gonna go see. I'm gonna talk to this nigga about. Ooh, Luffy's yeah, son. take it down, take it down, take it down. Okay. I heard Sanji. I heard Sanji. I heard the finesse Sanji of the five dresser. Sanji is fucking dead, bro. I heard Sanji. <laughs> All right, so wait, he said this nigga was talking to somebody. Sabo was talking to the, bird. the birds. Oh, so the birds are really a part of devil food. Use it as a part of the revolutionary army. You can Maybe. say that. You can say that. You could. Be, you can say that. That's a. That's a. That's a fair assumption. Yeah, yeah. that's a yeah. fair assessment. Yeah. Yeah. Um. So we have Sabo's backstory. You know, we had questions on why he didn't go help save Ace mm -hmm. in the battle of Marine Ford, and the reason why is because he. He lost his memory for quite some time, and you know he didn't get it back until uh, Sab, uh, Ace's death, which is why he shows up here in the first place. You know, one, he wants to get the flare flare fruit, and two, he's not gonna let another one of his brothers die. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So it was it was a beautiful and touching moment, um, and you know, which is why Sabo I feel like is one of my favorite characters in the show. Um, now we do see that you know Fujitoro again, like although a kainu gave him the the he told him like yo don't show up without capturing luffy in the gang he has the option to catch him and yep. decides not to negative mm -hmm. what do you guys think about that i mean i think was... that he wasn't gonna catch him regardless just because of the whole just because like what i had said before earlier about his morals and what he saw being done you know what i'm saying they stopped he fully stopped del flamingo and I think that would kind of go like even though he goes after the pirate, even though he is going after pirates and he is about his job, I think that would kind of go against what he did, um, what he did, where he kind of what, what, what I want to. Do you think it's I'm more about this? like do you think it's more about um, him just not following orders or about like what he I think it's his morals? Like, I think. Wait, it's, what do you mean? 
uh, how how am I? I'm trying to describe it. I don't know. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time describing this. But pretty much the fact that he even went to the public and he was like, "This is our fault. We take full responsibility for this because we let this happen." At the end of the day, I think because he did that and seeing Luffy did, seeing what Luffy did, where he pretty much saved a whole. He saved the whole town from and everybody from getting murdered at that point that he would not went after him regardless because even though he's a bad pirate, Luffy still did. Luffy and the Straw Hat still did good. I feel like he left sense? it more. He left it. I, I don't think it's really him deciding really not to do it. I think he's leaving it to, to destiny. Fate, to fate no, I, and destiny. I'm, I'm, I'm saying that. I'm saying that. I feel like not necessarily that he wasn't going to do it, but maybe he didn't want to do it because of what Luffy did. Well, no, he, no, the thing is, he, he wants to do it, right? He wants to do it, but that's why he, he mentioned it. He's like, yo, you can't you not notice how the how the paint has been dyed? Whatever like the, whatever, whatever he said right there is like, everything in this world is telling me not to capture this nigga. Mm-hmm. I roll a dice. One, don't capture Luffy. Two, three, four, five, six, capture right. Luffy. I roll a dice and it comes out, you know. I'm the, not meant to capture Luffy. Yeah, yeah. I, right at this very it's moment. Fate. Yeah, exactly. It's the power of D. D, yeah, I think bro. I think the it D could is be everything, bro. I'm I think it's to more you, so. Man. Yeah, I think it's more so of you are right. I think it's more so of the moment. Not, I'm not saying that he's not gonna want to capture him in the future because at the end of the day, he's still he's still part of the navy and he still does his job and he still goes after criminals. You know what I'm saying? And Luffy is considered a criminal. I'm just saying, like within the moment right now, considering everything that happened, it's just like to capture Luffy. Is he, right? is he still navy if he can't pull up to the navy shit? Well, technically, he's still navy. He's still navy. Then the guy would be like, Yo, you can't pull up. He can't pull up to any Navy base until you bring them niggas back. So you still got to so act as longer. a Navy and shit yeah. like that. Like, serve the purpose like, of yeah, being I don't want to see your face. Yeah, like, get yeah. the job done you before you come it. back type shit. You feel yeah. I me? Mean? It makes sense, though. I mean, you already said fuck you to a kind of, like, what he represents. Yeah, so you yeah. might as well keep that same energy and shit. Yeah, keep, you got to keep the same energy at all, all times and all do faith. But I don't know. Sabo, to me, is really creeping up. He's really becoming one of those characters that... I feel like he's way better than Ace officially now. Yes. I feel like there's more nice. and more detail to him. I feel like he was the gateway to uh, Luffy and having that brother. And I feel like just seeing the backstory of the sake drinking and all that, I just think there's going to be something epic and monumental to happen between those two brothers. Nah, that's a, that's a fact, bro. Yeah. Bro, shit. Sabo so really that nigga. Sabo really that nigga, bro. He did a lot in his, in his young years, yo. And the fact that, like, Yo, that's a fucked up situation. Like, yo, I had so much trauma, I forgot years of my life. That's like, damn, nigga. Like, shit, I never heard of that in my life. Well, I that's never... not what happened. You got to, nigga, got shot. You got blown up, my nigga. That's how he forgot the years of his life. What do you mean? Because the trauma. Yeah, I guess you. You feel me? It was more so mental. It was, it was like, as well. Pow, nigga, I lost my memory type shit. You feel me? And then it came. And he almost drowned. Like, yeah, yeah that's so a lot. Yeah, you, suffocation. You, like, you, you lose brain that, cells yeah, and shit. You definitely like that. lose shit when you suffocate. Yeah, real talk. Honestly, yo, bro. That was literally the best like explanation of why he wasn't there. Yeah. Cause I was trying to figure out I'm like, what fucking reason that nigga didn't know? So I'm like, all right, bro, that's that was beautiful, honestly. I'm like He he knew, but he is like he didn't know the importance of him being showing up. Exactly. You know yeah, yeah. I like the way that they structured it too. I like the way that they structured it too, where he lost his whole entire he it's like he lo- he didn't gain his memory until he saw that picture. Mm-hmm. I like that whole the yeah, whole build up. It. You you getting your predictor shit back, yo. you know what I'm saying, Dougie, you know. I'm saying and like the build up to it too was so amazing because it's like I get all those memories back and then in me getting my memories back the first thing I see is that my brother is dead and that what that's what reminds me of my brother my brother being dead and like the even the emotion like I almost cried in that sequence Mm -hmm. when um Sabo was crying because I felt that like Mm -hmm. so yo what made you cry get closer to crying more this or Ace dying um hmm I don't know. Exactly. When we, when we got to Ace know. dying, though, he wasn't there. Like, you watched it on your own. Oh, you know yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, you go. You're right, you're right. Yeah. Forget it. I bypass that. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Honestly. Uh, for now, for what I know now, I think this probably got me close to crying. Mm. Close to crying. That nigga Dragon don't, don't be doing Damn, shit Damn, nigga, didn't you cry during Ace? Me? 
Yeah, yeah I'm like, what this nigga talking about? Dude. Cry? I swear, no, you dude. actually cried. Though. I didn't cry. Yeah, man. I think you did, bro. I, didn't I think cry, you did. Nigga. Run the tape. I'm the, yeah, I'm the video. You definitely <laughs> cried. This nigga was definitely <laughs> crying. <laughs> cry, How you talking about that moment when you cried? <laughs> nah, he ruined the moment. <laughs> he ruined the moment, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, nigga, I didn't cry. Yeah, this nigga yeah. definitely cried. I didn't cry. You got me confused. He was watching a different reaction channel. He did. No, 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 no. I didn't cry. You cried. I cried. Nah, he did. I'm talking shit about it. No, I didn't cry. For Ace? For yeah, Ace? I was, I was talking was shit. Was fathers, was yeah, I know. Nah, I think I think one of y'all cried, yo. I and, yeah, I'm telling you, I talked shit about Ace right after, my I'm nigga. I'm trying to see if I could fight it and see if you did. It's pretty easy, my nigga. You find out. Now Ace I think about died. it, yeah, I almost wasn't. I definitely almost wasn't going to cry with Ace because I thought he was stupid for what he did. <laughs> this nigga said something new. This nigga passed. I was definitely I'm stressed. I'm stressed. Why are you crying, nigga? I'm going to pull up some comments here. Look at this shit. They got like stressed. They got like, ah, damn, this dumbass thing got killed, nigga. That's what it was. And if I almost cried, it wasn't because A's dying. It's because yeah, of Luffy. It's because of Luffy. If, if I cry, it's because of Luffy. You don't even know. Is it Luffy Blacks Out episode? Nah, it's uh, Kaino Kills Ace. You're not going to find. There'll be a timestamp. Oh, look at Patrick yeah. cried right yeah. here. After, I'm going to end this reaction, and then I'm, I'm going to find that yeah, shit. Yeah, I know yeah. I'm going to find that shit, yo. I know you was crying for A's, nigga. <laughs> I don't know, nigga. Uh, but it was an amazing two episodes, man. Sabo, top five non-straw hats for sure. The facts. Mm -hmm. So, stay tuned, guys. We are, I'm pretty sure, pretty wrapped up with Dress Rosa here. Um, we're getting into some other lit Best. stuff right after here. Mm. So, if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash, smash. that subscribe button. It's your boy Wells, the Anime King. <laughs> he cried. He cried <laughs> right there. He go to the next video and said, "Pat, are you okay?" Time stamp, Pat. <laughs> ah, you see, I knew he was crying, bro. <laughs> I was like crying. Nigga. Yes, he was, bro. I <laughs> knew he was crying. <laughs> I think in, our, it, in the post discussion, you actually even said like, "Yo, I was crying when this nigga died." <laughs> I swear you said that, bro. Yeah, I'm telling you, nigga, I be getting tired. Of this yeah, that nigga was crying because he wiped his eyes and he started shaking his leg and trying to stop nah, himself. One time of him crying was the Naruto's mom. Yeah, yeah nah, nigga, nah, he really cried. He really cried on that. Nah, video. they just showed him. He yeah, just showed I didn't video. cry. Nah, nah, nah. And <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure even in this discussion, you said you cried. You want to cry like Patrick? That's mad for this nigga hating on Ace. This nigga was crying. They ain't think for clout. Oh, nigga. At the end of the day, right, bro. You switched on it's during that Roger Biz podcast, though. Even before that. You. Even before yeah, that. on the podcast, because I remember I came and like, nigga, you used to like Ace. Yeah. Trust me, my nigga. Fuck Ace. Nah, nigga, you don't mean that. If you cried for him, you don't mean that. I, I can't <laughs> cry for a person I hate. I don't know. There's people that... They love people say love and hate is the same thing, my nigga. So There's you, a lot of people that I'm love and hate. The, the, the reason hate, why, bro. the reason I brought it up is because you was trying to say this moment. So I, I know, know. I yeah. know. Like, we, you we, didn't yeah. cry for this moment, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you cry for Ace. I'm a little bit, though. I'm not gonna lie, nigga. It's a tear jerker, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> but that one actually jerked the tear. <laughs> no, the tear got jerked. That shit was. Oh, well, everybody went. No one even spoke. Nobody even started. People have been trying to expose the nigga. It's like that. I forgot to talk about names. <laughs> I, didn't well, well, well. <laughs> I didn't cry, nigga. My eyes, you know. I gotta, <laughs> Everybody know you cried. Nigga, I have to tell you, I got tired, my nigga. It was, it was a long. We, we reacted like six different videos that day. It was the last video, nigga. Patrick on too, nigga. Yo, I'm the one. The rest is twos and threes. It's Amanda Myth the Maniac. Wilkinson and Scar T. Sanji's coming back. It's your boy DC. And that settles it at the round, round table. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! Oh. I'm like, what the I fuck? I don't know what just happened. <laughs> <laughs>